Hey guys, welcome to a new video featuring the strongest pet in the game right now, the horse. It got newly added with the new update. You can obtain it by going to the southeast region, talking with this escort shopkeeper, with, like he is located down here. Then after having talked with him, you need to leave the map and find a thousand bamboo creek which can just be explored. You essentially just head up the river to this rough location and it will automatically appear on the map. Once you do so, you just go through the bamboo creek a bit and at some point you will find a broken cart, which should be right here. If you go near it, a cutscene will trigger afterwards, the horse will appear. Now, why exactly is the horse the best pet right now? First of all, its speed ties with the wolf and the snow cup. So it's the fastest speed out of all pets with those two other ones when traveling through the overworld with the depart function. And furthermore, it has one amazing buff, which is take the lead. After entering the battle, the character's evasion increases by 10% and action speed increases by 15%. This is a whole party buff. So if I start the battle right now, you can see Fanatical Raven gains the take the lead status. As such, I also get the increased action speed from it. Now I'd have to find it somewhere there you go. Evasion increases by 10% uh, and action speed by 15%, which puts me at a perfect 300. Now additionally, it has another unique modifier, however, this one is currently bugged and I'll do some demonstrations of why it is bugged. It would be the trait wind speed and lightning speed. The protagonist's movement speed increases by 30% when moving on the big map. Now what is the big map they talk about? My initial thought was this map, when you move around without your pet. Now well, I, let me meditate for a second. There you go, 1am, this makes it easier. If I move between Linen and the Langya Sword Pavilion, it's going to take like 3 hours and sometimes 2 hours and 45 minutes. Like there you go, 245, 3 hours, 3 hours, 245, 3 hours, 3 hours, 245. It's very consistent. Now if I switch out the horse with the wolf, and the wolf does not have that modifier, the exact same thing will happen. It's still going to be, in this case, 3 hours, 2.45, 3 hours, 3 hours, 2.45, 3 hours, 3 hours, you get the gist. There is no difference in move speed across those. Now the next thought I had is maybe when you actually depart with an animal, perhaps the time spent is different from what it shows. So we'll start in Linan, head to the Herbology sect, which takes 4 hours to Shishin and well, we'll rest a moment so it's like 12 a.m. So we should normally end up at 4 a.m. And look at that, it's actually 4 a.m. If we do the same thing with the horse, it's going to be the same result. So for some reason this one trait does not work. But once again, simply getting the action speed buff from the horse and while well, the evasion buff does not matter that much, makes it the best pet. And you can see we started at 4am, we end up at 8am, it's the exact same. So this trade does not work. And also just to show the speed comparison that it actually ties the wolf for the high speed, going from Linand to the Divine Flame sect takes 8 Shishin and 6 K. And if we compare it with the wolf, it's going to yield the same result. There you go. Thanks for watching. Remember to get the new, the new horse pet and have a nice day, everybody.